I'm surprised James let you in on a Sunday. Things are bad. He's in trouble, Cyrus. This is real. Amanda Tanner is pregnant. I need to know if he maybe took precautions with Amanda. You want to know if the president wore condoms when he slept around? I don't know. I think that's your area. Did he wear one with you? How much? I could probably sell 10 million. Over five years. Over three. I'll see what I can do. You and I aren't friends anymore. Don't come here again. When I feel she is choosing another side, when I understand, I get a glimpse of how much I don't know about what was, what I thought was uh, us living in almost one room. I realized, no, it wasn't quite one room. <laughs> you, know? <laughs> you know? And, um, and I think that scares Cyrus. Um, and puts him into has this within four or five big now, mother hen mode, you know, of protectivity. Never let a crisis go to waste, Mr. President. Make the call. In our the sixth episode, actually, is this really brilliant um, flashback episode where you go back and you find out, you know, through a series of circumstances, you will get to experience how Fitz and Livy met. And how mm -hmm. Cyrus, you know, during the campaign, and it's a really, it's a really great hour of television. Um, uh, so it becomes more central and um, approaches resolution, <laughs> but um, no, it just gets more impossible. You know, it seems yeah, it to be seems fixed, like it and then it gets worse. Impossible, and, and then, then it gets, gets better, worse. and it gets worse. Worse, and then <laughs> the end, the end episode. Um, I, you know, we can't give it away, but. Um, uh, uh, Terrible things happen and extraordinary things happen, um, and um, at the, I'd, say it's, I'd say it leaves on another. There's another, you know, multiple cliffhangers at the end of the first season. Yeah.